Hi. Firstly, I'd just like to acknowledge the traditional custodians of the lands I'm recording this on today. I'd also like to pay my respects to their elders past, present and emerging and acknowledge and extend that respect to other Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people and elders from other communities who might be watching this today. My name's Sophie Bond and I'm a practice facilitator at Western Victoria Primary Health Network. One of the really common questions we often get asked as practice facilitators is just how to delete the primary mental health care referral template from best practice. You'd probably be doing this once a new version has been released. You want to search for the old version first, delete it out and ensure that that one is not used so that you don't get any um, referral knockbacks. So I thought I'd just create a very quick clip to show you how this can be done. Okay, so you'd log into best practice. If you go to Utilities, go to Word Processor, brings up this page. If you go to Templates and go to Use Template, it'll bring up the list of all the templates you have and your clinical software. If you then scroll down for the template that you're looking to delete, so in our instance, it's PHN, PMHC Referral, Best Practice, and you just literally click Delete. So that's easily done. Um, one thing that I probably would point out is just if your if clinicians are saving things as templates as favourites, so if they're actually logging into the clinical software and saving um, referral templates as favourites, you then need to go into their clinical software under their login and delete that as a favourite. So it's just a good idea to keep that in mind and maybe um, advise all the clinicians when a new template's released that you've removed it from the system. If they have it as a favourite, they need to then review, remove that as a favourite as well. Okay. That's all. Thanks for listening. We also have a few extra clips on just importing a template um, into best practice and also how to create a sex successful referral. Um, so thank you for watching and if you need any more information, please get in touch.